This is America. We have the founding fathers that wrote the Constitution that we haven't lived by in 142 years. Hello, everybody. How are you? I hope everybody's doing fine. I really do. You know, come home today, and the first thing I seen on my Facebook page, wow, really? Now, I'm going to show you a stuffed toy, and it's a basketball. Just imagine it's round. Okay. It's not completely round. It's supposed to be round, but you know, it is uh, an animal toy. You see? Basketball. Okay. Now, I want you to play real close attention to this. It's round. See? You know, this is round as you can get. See? It's round. But it's flat. That shit's flat. Did you know that? It is. It's flat. It's flat, folks. It really is flat. Now, I'm not lying. It's flat. Can't you tell it's flat? Let me tell you. Let me show you how. You want me to show you? I'm going to show you. See this? Look, watch right here. See right here? It's flat on one side all the damn way around. Do you see that? So is the earth. So is your baseball. So is your football. So is your car tire. Your car's got a flat on one side all the way around. Now, do you know what was on my Facebook now? Yes, you do. The world's greatest gimmick of all time. The world's flat. Hmm. There's scientific proven fact that the world's flat. Yep, it sure as hell is. Look at here. One more time. You see it? On one side, all the way around. It's flat. On one side, all the way around. In any direction you want to go. They didn't say that. But it's flat on one side, all the way around. So is the moon. So is the sun. <coughs> Mars, Jupiter, the whole nine yards. Flat on one side, all the way around. That pissed you off, didn't it? Oh, boy. We got all the time in the world. Nothing's happening nowhere on the planet. Nowhere on the planet about anybody trying to help themselves be free. They just worried about the flat planet. And they worried about asteroids coming in going to destroy us. Oh, my God. Is there any damn thing that anybody can do about any of that? I, I just want to know. And Jade Helm, it, oh man, Jade Helm is the biggest damn story since sliced pussy. Excuse my French. I, I mean, it's all over the place. That's why the meteor's coming. Nibiru was coming. I mean, it's coming. It's breaking damn news. It is. It's breaking news. It's the biggest breaking news story that you're ever going to see. It is. Nibiru is back in the news again. It, it, it is. Oh, it is. <clears throat> I'm going to say something else, and it's going to piss a lot of people off. I'm old enough and been around long enough that I've seen this happen more than once or twice. We've seen Nibiru since 2012, or I mean 2000 and 2001 actually. It's been coming ever since 2001. In fact, you really, really want to know the truth, it was coming in 1995. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. For the ones of you that haven't been following it, and the ones of you that have long enough, know all this. It's coming every year. Every year, it's coming. 
Uh, I just seen a big story that Google has allowing you to see it again in the space. They don't have it blocked out no more. It's moved. Oh my God. Really? Uh, well, I did the search. I couldn't find it. I, maybe I wasn't doing it right. Hell, I don't know. Folks, I'm serious. I, I really am serious. There's a lot of you folks out there that are playing these games with fear. Anything you can do to sit at home and stay on your computer and make a dollar. That's a proof of fact. I ain't got to go show you no demonstration of who, when, where, how. Y'all all know who you are. Yeah, you know who you are. And I'm not saying that Jade Helm ain't real. It is. It's really happening. And I ain't going off on anybody that's handling Jade Helm. Except for the ones that are telling you that there's a big red planet coming. <laughs> the dark star. It's coming to get you. It's going to blow up the world. You know, the biggest thing that we really have to worry about from outer space is what CERNs is doing on this planet. It's going to create something from the sun that this planet's not used to. That's the only thing I see that could possibly happen to our planet. But yet, Nibiru's coming. Oh my God, is it coming? Uh, and on a, a like of not really wanting to do this and not hurting some people's feelings because I understand where you're coming from and there is a lot of things that do look that way but with that being said uh, God won't help those that won't help themselves now that's in the Bible. You can look that up. And that's in just about every one of them, too. It ain't just in one or two, or, or just the one, all of the Christians. It ain't just in that one. It's in all of them that had the Word of God, or supposed to have the Word of God in them. <coughs> Folks, I'm not going off on religion. I have my own beliefs. About God I know there's a supreme being that's my theory I know that where when and how it come about all the stories that you can tell me every book you can show me my theory is the man put us here to think for ourselves it's just my I thought he gave you the power to be intelligent and smart enough to know what, when, and where was going to be or happen. Also gave you the knowledge to be free. You just have to use it. Not hide behind someone that's trying to steal your rights away and make you think there's a big bed of roses on the other side of the fence. You know, it's, it's a damn shame you have to come home or you come home tired, wore out, and you see the first thing that you see is something just this extremely off the wall. And one of the last stories that I posted, new story, was about Jesse Ventura, us 
working together to get him to run for president and get him elected for our freedoms. Mm. Very few people picked it up. Very few people agreed. Everybody calls him a shield, just like I said in my video. They didn't watch my video. They just seen parts of the video. You know, it's really a shame, folks. It's really a shame that the folks and the people that are out here can't agree on anything. I guess it was, not was, I guess it is, completely designed for y'all. Because y'all don't believe it unless it's on TV or on the news. Everything else is an all-out lie. It's all total bullshit. So, I guess when the Pope says, Oh, bend over, let me kiss your butt. Everyone's going to bend over and let him, whatever. People, God gave you a brain to think. To know when you were being led or showing, being shown the light. There's a difference. Being led into doing things you shouldn't do or teaching you the real spirits of this land and your God and your freedoms. You were born free for moments. Freedom was taken away from you as soon as they signed that birth certificate. Does anyone care? I, I don't see that no one cares. They just want to be slaves. They want to chase the little orange ball, the little make-believe planet that's supposed to be coming. Or they want to tell you that everybody's going to a cave because of the little orange planet. That's what Jade Ham's all about. Have you ever really thought that it might not be the round ball coming at all? And it might not be Russia or China or the United States doing anything. Have you ever thought that it could be just plain old ass CERN? Plan God. Don't you think that God Himself, if they wanted them to know all of that, He would allow them to find that out real fast. Especially if He thought it was going to destroy what He has created. Now, are they going to figure it out? I don't know. Are they going to destroy the world? I don't know that either. I just know when you got a round ball like this and you got a, this is the north, and this is the south, and you got them like this, and you got another magnetic pole on the side, and then the sun is over here, that, that magnetic field right there, as you know, when the sun or rays come, you got the field right here comes out over around the earth and it goes in through the north and the south pole but if you got one here then you got that pole coming here going there and then going here right and it's plain on the back and they do it during the daylight hours now it's on all the time they say I, I don't know but they're doing the experiments when the sun is up when they're everybody's awake so am I saying that it could cause anything? I'm saying it's possible. I'm saying that we could have major earthquakes. I'm saying we could have volcanoes to erupt. In fact, we already have. 
Some that hadn't done it in a very long time. You know, I was going to make a one minute video. I just can't do it, folks. I, I can't. I try. I was going to come in here and make you the, the round planet thing. One, It's flat on one side all the way around. I was going to do just one minute of that. I, I was. But I, I just, I, I can't. I tried. That one minute got away from me. I want to be free. I want your children and my children to have a life. We need our children to spread the truth because of us older cats like me and some of y'all out there, we're not going to be here no more very much longer. We got 20 years maybe, 10 of it good, last 10 not so great, maybe seen out, whatever the case may be. Or don't no one want to believe you because you're old. That's why you need to do it while you're in your younger age. You ones of you to 38, 40 years old. You really start need to push the truth. <clears throat> you can make it to where you make money doing the same thing the same way. You just got to do it and want it and do it hard enough and do it the right way. Some of you out there are a whole lot smarter than I am. You can do it. So why ain't you? That's my only question. Why aren't you? Why aren't you doing it? It's not all about the glamours of the little orange planet coming to the earth or the sun or the atmosphere solar stars it ain't got nothing to do with all that it's got to do about your freedoms most of you people wouldn't even be doing that you wouldn't be making a dime you wouldn't be making a dime if you hadn't have got into this for the right reasons to start with. And you only stuck with what sells. If we don't start making freedom sell, we gonna lose. Your kids are gonna be slaves to the massive corporate entity and their children, they might not even get to be built, get to even be born. So with that folks, from my cold dead hands, abolish corporate government for your freedoms. And remember, remember this, you see this? It's flat, don't ever forget it, it's flat on one side all the way around. So is your car tire. It's flat. If you don't believe me, go outside and look at it. It's flat on one side. All the way around. Have a great evening. Much love to y'all. Y'all have a good day night here. Don't forget to follow Tattoo1009.com on Facebook and Twitter and YouTube and to the motion and stumble upon. Please help spread the word by sharing our articles on your favorite social networks. Go to the links in the below section for updates every day. From my cold dead hands abolish the corporate government.